I'm here with the legendary jewellery polymath, <laughs> social historian and author Geoffrey Munn, famous from the Antiques Roadshow and lots more besides. We are actually doing a coronation special inside the Queen Mary room at Garrard. This is where the Queen Mary crown was first presented to Queen Mary and it's what the Queen Consort will be wearing on the day of the coronation. You must um, subscribe to my podcast feed if Jules could talk. You do not want to miss this and hear Geoffrey's words of wisdom. And we're going to be talking about your book, Geoffrey. Yes. Tell us a little bit about your book, please. Well, um, thank you, first of all, for inviting me to do this. It's a wonderful, wonderful subject, a magical subject, if not a holy one, really. And, um, and, and so it is a, a, a privilege to talk to you about these remarkable uh, uh, objects. Um, it has been a huge success. I didn't really think um, that a, a very narrow focus of jewellery would be quite as successful. It was an absolutely magnetic subject. It went beyond a, a, an exhibition I put on at Wartsky of uh, 111 tiaras and then went on to the Victoria and Albert Museum. And wherever there was great jewellery, royal jewellery shown, then it attracted huge crowds. And we had queues going round the block here, just round the corner, and we had them at the Victoria and Albert Museum. And um, it's difficult to define quite what the magic is, but we're doing our best in this podcast. And they'll be queuing on the day of the coronation. Well, they will. I hope so. I mean, we're more than queuing. There'll be thousands of people. They'll be mobbed. They'll be up and down the mall. And um, no, it'll be it'll be a magic, wonderful, rare, holy day. And I don't say holy lightly. It is a sacrament, the coronation. And you can hear all about the coronation and the regalia and the jewels on If Jewels Could Talk. <laughs>